Oh, hello, welcome back to Plumbing College. Today, I'm going to teach you about plastic pressure pipe, also known as push fit pipe or barrier pipe. We will be covering how to cut, join and test the pipe. We will also look at the pros and cons. The pipe comes in the same sizes as copper. 15 millimetres, 22 millimetres. Let me show you how to cut and join the pipe. To cut the pipe, you must use an appropriate pipe cutter. Never use a hacksaw. This could compromise the seals and the fittings. Today, I'm going to use pipe shears. There are a variety of fittings available. Here I have a 15mm T, a 15mm elbow and a 15mm coupling. Always make sure the fittings are complete and have an o-ring, washer and collet. You will also need an insert to put in the pipe. Let's join some pipe. Right, firstly, cut the pipe on the guidance mark. Put the insert into the pipe. And we now push the pipe into the fitting. When the guidance mark has disappeared, we know the pipe has been inserted enough and we finally tighten the nuts. Pressure pipe also works with compression fittings. Make sure your insert is compatible. Check with the manufacturer's instructions. The fittings are also compatible with copper pipe. It's good practice to mark on the pipe the insertion depth. In college, you would Pressurise your work using a hydraulic tester to five bar and instantly you would see if there are leaks. <laughs> to remove the pipe, undo the nut push in the collet and pull the pipe out. There is no need to take the nut off. If the nut does come off and the internals come out, make sure you put them back in the right order. Remove the insert. With pressure pipe, it cannot be used on gas because of the building regulations if there was a fire. It cannot be used within the first metre of a boiler and it does not look as good as copper when it's on display. Now you know about pressure pipe. It's your turn to have a go.